More than 18,000 San Diegans landed new jobs last month, showing that the worst of our economic woes may be over. We're exploring the hiring landscape as part of our rebound initiative. ABC 10 News reporter John Horn explains why we still have a long way to go to dig out of the hole. We lost a ton of money, like that's the bottom line. Eric Adler doesn't hold back when he talks about how hard 2020 has been for Puesto, an artisan Mexican restaurant chain he co-founded in 2012. I mean, this year is, is going to be obviously a terrible year for for businesses, for, for us. But coronavirus restrictions are lifting and restaurants can once again host guests. Puesto, no exception. It's planning to open its new Mission Valley location in July in need of 150 workers. That's why it held a hiring fair there Friday. We're optimists and we believe that things are going to get better. Friday's jobs report a new sign that things are in fact getting better. It showed that more than 18,000 San Diegans got hired in May, with 9,100 of those coming in the hard-hit food service industry. Still, San Diego County has a long way to go. Year over year, payroll employment is still down by a staggering 195,800 workers. The positive thing is that uh, the worst is behind us and we've seen month over month job growth. So we're improving. The negative spin is that we're improving, but the situation is still bad. In addition to the Mission Valley Puesto, Adler says the restaurant chain is rehiring the upwards of 600 employees it had at other locations. I think it's going to be pretty much everyone. Everyone that wants a job back is going to be hired. In other words, jobs are coming back, albeit slowly. John Horn, ABC 10 News. San Diego County's unemployment rate stayed flat at 15% from April to May. One year ago, it was just 2.8%. And we have links to all sorts of job search resources in a special section of our website, 10news.com rebound.